name is Madeline Bailey. I am originally from Wisconsin, born and raised um, in a very tiny town where there were uh, more cows than human beings. YouTube sensation Madeline Bailey is now an AGT star, but I bet there are some things you might not know about her. That's what's hot. Social media sensation Madeline Bailey has been one of the most buzzworthy contestants on season 16 of America's Got Talent. The singer, with 8 million subscribers on YouTube, has gotten a combination of both love and hate online. But she has been able to turn those hate comments into some iconic songs like the one she sang for her viral AGT audition. Let's take a deep dive into 10 facts you might not know about her. 1. Madeline opened up about having dyslexia. The singer, who was born and raised in a small town in Wisconsin, has openly spoken about having dyslexia. Growing up, there were people that told her she would have trouble reading and that academics would be hard for her. She has since used that as fuel and channeled it into her successful singing career. She said, I think my dyslexia has a lot to do with my instant connection to music. I didn't really have to try with music. I feel like it has helped me tremendously with being a creative person, especially with songwriting. Songwriting to me is just my zone, it just makes sense for me. Two. Her grandmother's death inspired her song, Red Ribbon. Madeline's grandmother, Cheryl Noah, was her number one fan growing up. She lit up every room when she walked into it. She's fiery, sassy, uh, kind of nosy. Cheryl was diagnosed with bone and lung cancer in 2018. About 20 days after she was diagnosed, she passed away. <laughs> Her song, Red Ribbon, helped get her out of the darkest parts of her grief. She invited some of the most inspiring women in her life to share their stories for the music video. 3. Madeline's family fosters children. Over the course of her childhood, Madeline had over 50 foster siblings. I have three brothers and two sisters, and then growing up we um, had a lot of different foster siblings come in and out, so there were a lot of love children in our house. She was homeschooled until high school, which gave her free time to practice music and spend time with her family. She said, I got to connect with very powerful emotions very young. These children go through some really terrible things at a young age and yet are so resilient it helps you see that some really bad things can happen and you can still be okay. In 2017, Madeline shared that her family adopted her sibling Millie after fostering her for three years. 4. She worked at a nursing home before becoming famous. Madeline worked at a nursing home before she became a viral internet sensation. She worked there mostly full time so she could afford her tickets to LA to work on new music. The job taught her about hard work and it seems like she's much happier now pursuing the career that she loves. She quit the job in 2020 to focus on music full time. 5. She would be in a very different field if she wasn't a singer. Madeline started writing songs at 7 years old, but in high school she was part of the Science Olympiad, a competitive science club. She did earn a medal at state and enjoyed it a lot. So if she wasn't doing music, she said she would be doing something in the chemistry or forensic field. We got a little detective over here, you guys. You need to do it differently on YouTube. I don't know what would it be? If I wasn't, if I was completely not a musician, I might be a gamer. When I am not in my studio creating music, I tend to be in my gaming room playing video games. This is my gaming room. Yeah, I got myself like a really nice gaming chair. I have my PlayStation, my Xbox. Six. Madeline is happily married. Madeline got engaged to James Benrund on Valentine's Day in 2014. The pair were married that August. They are about to celebrate their seventh wedding anniversary and he's her biggest fan when it comes to supporting her music, going on tour, and just on social media. He's actually also pretty hilarious, so maybe he'll put his comedy chops to the test on America's Got Talent in the future. 7. She has gone through a serious hair transformation. 
If you've been a longtime fan of Madeline since she started her YouTube channel over a decade ago, you may have noticed she has gone through quite the makeover. She first had a short bob haircut before shaving the side of her head in 2012, right around the first time one of her videos hit 1 million views. Then she sported a side cut with red tips before growing her long, icy blonde locks. She chopped the hair one last time before sporting her long curls again for her AGT performance. Eight, she opened up about financial struggles in the past. During the time she wrote Trunk on a Feeling, Madeline was struggling financially even though she hit 1 million subscribers on YouTube in October 2013. It was not always easy following a career path on YouTube. She didn't know if she could afford making YouTube videos any longer and she felt like she was missing important events in Wisconsin while living in LA. She later realized not to judge her success based on how much money she makes. But if you really want to know, Madeline's estimated net worth is hard to pinpoint. Some outlets reported as 2.3 million and others reported as 7.5 million. If she was actually making 7.5 million dollars, why would she go on America's Got Talent? Nine, Madeline appeared in a pizza commercial with one famous talent show judge. You guys, who doesn't love pizza? Well, Madeline sang and danced in a DiGiorno pizza commercial with the X Factor Australia judge, Red Foo, in 2017. Sure, the dancing was a little bit awkward, but I feel like it's pretty cool that she was in a commercial for one of my favorite drunk foods. 10. Madeline is an animal lover. Madeline has one thing in common with Simon Cowell. She absolutely loves animals. Growing up, she had Siamese rats. She's also a loving dog mom. Her dog named Booger passed away in September 2020. She opened up about it in an emotional Instagram post. She has an entire Instagram page dedicated to her other dogs, Baby, Buddy, and Bella. So cute. Did you guys know all those facts about Madeline? I know there are some diehard fans out there, so let me know down below anything that I may have missed. As always, while you're on YouTube, you should hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Follow Talent Recap on all social medias and head over to talentrecap.com because we have all the scoop on your favorite AGT stars. If you want to follow me on Instagram, it's at SamanthaX373, but be careful if you comment something mean, I might turn it into a song. I'm Samantha for Talent Recap, and now you know what's hot. Hey, what are you doing tonight? Well, I think you should hit the subscribe button down below and then we can talk.